Welcome back. An innovative solution to a challenge facing mountain communities, employee housing. And we've reported on the housing shortages and the different ways people are trying to address it. We got to say this is a new one though. One ski area is leasing a motel. As Denver 7's Liz Gilardi shows us, it could be a model for future projects. Employees keep the lifts turning, ski areas running. They make your coffee for those early mornings in the mountains, but they can't find housing. I had no idea it was so hard to find housing up here. It's pretty slim. Leah Roderick moved back to Colorado and landed a job in Idaho Springs. That part was easy. I found the job like within hours, so I figured there'd be housing up here, but it's been like three weeks and nothing's really come up, so. I don't know what to do. She's not alone and at ski areas, the housing crunch can make it hard to find or keep employees. It's more challenging. I mean, it is everywhere, right? That's why Loveland Ski Area is leasing this old motel in Idaho Springs, about 25 miles from the slopes. So we have a master lease with these two real estate agents who purchased the property. And this was a quick way for us to get some housing for this season while we work on the longer term solution. Employee housing has always been a challenge in mountain communities, but officials here at Loveland say they've noticed a difference since the COVID-19 pandemic. Now housing is even harder for employees to find. We're going to have to do something. For Loveland, the challenge is magnified. It's not located in a town and it doesn't even have lodging for guests. People have to find housing in any of these tiny little towns up and down the I-70 corridor, and it, there's not a place that like all employees would be housed in one place, which some of the other resorts have. The ski area also runs a shuttle up to five times a day. The bus picks up employees along I-70, even stopping in Morrison, which is quite the commute, but for some, the only option. During peak season, Loveland has 650 employees. This new housing only covers 5% of the workforce, but it's a start. And the 30 employees living here have one less worry. Liz Gilardi, Denver 7.